Hey everybody, welcome. I am Joe. This I'm Brad. And we are out here doing uh out in nature. What's this weird outdoor stuff? We I know don't go it's, a little, right it's a little different. You know, fresh air, not stuck in a room somewhere. Yeah. A little different. It is December. No it snow is. on the ground though. Little, Last time we were outside. It's a, it's a little brisk. It is. Yeah. A little brisk. It is. It's been a while since we, uh, we've been on here, but you know, we're trying to get back into the swing of things. Yeah. So I know you're always used to seeing something like this. A little Lego creation. However, today got something a little different. A little different. A little bigger. How much horsepower would you say this is? So we're going from maybe what, one thousandth of a horsepower? And this is what you consider green going off of batteries. There you go, yeah. Yeah. Very efficient. Very efficient. Very, very modern right here. Now we're going to go to the dark side. That's right. Something a little bit bigger, four and a half horsepower, but not in Lego. Not in Lego. Something. And something that's not clean for the environment, Joe. No, no. This is uh, a little bit bigger, four and a half horsepower. This is my 25 ton switcher right here. And I've done a conversion on this one to be a ride astride, is what they call it, so that you're sitting across it as such. And so this kind of gives you a little bit of that scale that we're looking at here. This is a seven and a half inch gauge track that we're on, and it is 1.5 inch scale. So this whole thing right here, I don't even know how long this loop is, but we've got two loops an inner loop here and then an outer loop that goes around the back side that we're going to go ahead and go for a ride on and kind of check out some of these other hobbies that we have uh, get to know us a little bit more and you know all the things that we buy that we probably shouldn't buy because lego's already expensive enough so if this is something that you want to see more of go ahead and comment down below that you want to see more of the one and a half inch scale stuff or you know, if you want to see this maybe built out of Lego and we can circle back to Lego, let's go with that. But uh, for now, let's get some beauty shots and then we'll go for a ride. Okay, so we're doing a little comparison here, you know, 1,000th horsepower, four and a half. All right, we're going to do 1, the- 1,000? Yeah, 1,000th 1, of a horsepower. Mega engine for the Lego. Mega, mega. All right, All right so we're going to do a start comparison. You ready, Joe? Yep. All right, here we go. Okay, mine's on. I'm ready to go. How about you, Joe? Yeah, yeah, it's running. <laughs> It's quiet. It's <laughs> is that is that the environmental quiet exhaust? That's, that's right. That's the the Flintstone power engine. Yeah. 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 All right. Well. All right. <laughs> Eventually it'll start. Eventually it'll start. Oh, my bad. You that's know, right. Joke. There, there we go. go. All right. I think we're finally ready to go for a ride. I think All so. aboard. All aboard. All aboard. You gotta race me. Oh yeah? Yeah, yeah, right? I can do that. Okay, no track. Here we go. You got a little bit of track. But... Not enough. All right. Who's going to win? Okay, that goes a little faster. So what? Uh, I'll come back for you. I won't <laughs> leave you behind.
This is Brad's first time ever riding this train, ever controlling it. We'll see if he goes crazy out of there. See what happens. Hey, I'm going to want that back at some point. I'm going to want that back at some point. I know, right? <laughs> Maybe. We'll see. It'll come back to me one day. The loop only goes so far. <laughs> 